Alright, uh, this is just a quick little video of my little, another servo retract controller. And what it basically does is control one servo, it's an output, um, and it basically allows you to set the two endpoints for this endpoint, left and right, and also the speed at which the servo goes. So what I have it hooked up to is a servo, and I'll pull it out later on to show you, but this is the retract that's going to be here. I don't have the cover on, but that's normally how the cover would look. So the wheel would be pretty hidden. Um, and I have it programmed there already, so we'll just show here. We're just going to use my servo tester here. Um, as if I was to flip the switch. And it comes up at a nice speed. And it goes down at a nice speed. Pretty scale. And when it's hanging down, the motion is going to be even... Uh, that I notice it kind of sticks a little when it goes up. Um, but that's it. And basically what that mechanism looks like, because it's not glued in here yet, I'll show you. If it's easy to get out, that is. With one hand. This is what it looks like. Um, it's just a little high-tech servo wire. And this is a robot tail wheel assembly. So basically, uh, pushes and pulls. I'll just get it going here real quick. So you can get an idea of how it works. That's it in operation. So that all that goes inside the plane like this. I'm gonna epoxy that all in with some support braces and everything. And this will be hooked up to my uh, regular landing gear um, that I'll be putting in the uh, the wing which is over there alright that's it anyways it's a neat little controller